I didn't want to be going to a fancy dress party wearing something that everyone else was wearing. I had a designer myself. I started when I was about 17 selling costumes online. My dad's hallway, there was, there was two shelves, one on the left, one on the right, and you had to squeeze right through the middle to get through. It wasn't until his, his whole house was just full of boxes and costumes that I had to move out. We now sell to about 70 countries around the world. Halloween for us is the biggest month of the year. It's very disappointing if you can't fulfill the demand. So the finance process was quite straightforward. I was a little bit daunted by how complicated I thought it would be, but actually it was much easier than that. A guy called Richard Easton came down and took me through the process. I showed him around. I found it a lot easier showing somebody the business rather than writing it down and showing them a complicated business plan. It's helped us purchase additional stock ready for the Halloween season. Halloween is massive in the US and we just signed a contract with a logistics partner who will be managing all our distribution in the US. We've been working on the development of new costumes, which has been really exciting actually. That'll be ready next year. It's made a massive difference to me. I felt it quite disappointing when I we can't fulfill our potential. I knew we could do a lot better, so it's actually helped us fill that gap and be where I think we should be. Oh, Nathan! <laughs>